Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This video is the max building countdown number 3. But before that please subscribe and like this video. In my last video of max building countdown my remaining buildings are level 24 beast trap, level 9 charcoal depot 3 and level 21 farm. In that video also the Charcoal Depot 3 is already at the preparation stage for level 10 that's why in this video I only prepare Beast Trap to level 10. And only used 33.6 million woods, 23.6 million stones and 13.8 million gold. After I prepared that and waited for the building day I was hoping to get the 8th chest and almost forgot that the next building day will be the first of this account on Dino Island. Maybe you will notice that on the day I uploaded this video it was already one week past. I apologize for that thing. Yes, it's too late because I was busy building up our clan strategy on this Dino Island and don't have time to edit this video in the past week. I'm lucky enough that after I max all my buildings there's also some source of points for the greatest continent and get the chest reward. On the day of building day I finish the charcoal depot and beast trap to its max level and gain points almost at 8th chest. Also include the farm to max its level. I aim for the 9th chest today because I have a fortification backbone for building fortification and some points from capturing holds and building lookouts. But sad to say I didn't get the 9th chest. The extra points were wasted because of the dream of getting the 9th chest. But I still hope to get the 9th chest next week, next building day. Here after I max out all my buildings I also fortify my building on Dino Island this is where I got my other points. In my previous video about building a fortification guide I laid there the buildings prior to fortifying. Hope you will watch it and gain some info about the building fortification. Our subtopic for this video is about the season shop. A season shop is available after the Dino Island opens. And this shop will reset weekly. In this shop there are plenty of good items available but you need a keeled scale to buy those items. The best items here are promotion badge, one star legendary beast, natural essence, ancient scroll and fortification backbone. There are also resources and speed ups available here. But in this video I will let you know what should be a priority to buy in this shop. First is the promotion badge so you have an addition to the star up of your heroes. Second is the legendary beast. All F2P and minimal spenders aim to get legendary beasts and promotion badges. Third is the ancient scroll which is also a supplement to the research of tier 10. Next is the Fortification Backbone, if your Keeled Scale is still able to buy the Fortification Backbone buy it but depends on if you still need Fortification Backbone to fortifying the building. But if not, the Natural Essence is the best to take, so you can evolve your statue. But the Keeled Scale is only abundant in the first and second week. Because in the first week there is a keeled scale given from the mission and also from capturing buildings. In the second week there are many keeled scales on the T-Rex if you do the attacking. But in the following weeks there are no more great source of keeled scale, so you need to prioritize the items that you will really benefit for. You can get the keeled scale every day in the following. You can get from daily quest 300 and 500 points, then from attacking wild creatures and barbarians. The higher the level, the more is given. So attack the high level you can so you don't waste your chance of getting a keeled scale. Next is by gathering. Whether it's stone or pelt or maybe woods and foods. 
that also gives you a keeled scale. This method is only based on the normal method of obtaining a keeled scale. Excluding events. I don't have much else to say, but the video is still long. Hee hee hee. So just bear with me and watch me fortify the building. That's all for our video thanks for watching my nonsense video, baboosh.